get out of my bathtub, lady. I wanted a nice, quiet hotel room. Hello and welcome. I am Virtue. We are playing Phobia. This is a demo of the main game. It's not out yet, and the game kind of gives me Outlast vibes. It looks like if Outlast was a puzzle horror rather than just a walking from place to place horror. We're going to check this out. So play the story mode and feel the phobia. Go new game. Hotel Santa Danina. Ooh. What's this game got for me? Oh, my head. What have they done to me? What have they done here? Those bastards. They made a mess in here. Don't mess up my room. This is my room. I, I like it just so. I like it quite tidy, and you've really ruined things. So let's have a look at my phone first. Wireless phone, electronic equipment. We can't use. We can only return. Oh, wow. It's like we can check in all the drawers. Oh, God. Uh, hello? Why are you doing knocking on my door at this time of night? I can't even open my door. Look, I want to let you. I really want to let you in. I really do, but apparently the game won't let me. Let's have a look at this door. Oh my god, that's scary. Why did they lock the bathroom? Okay, so kind of escape room vibes. There's there's a tutorial here, and I'm just clicking through it. So we'll we'll see. We'll we'll work this out as we go along. Such is life. So we'll check for all the drawers first. I think that's probably a sensible thing to do. If I was to be missing keys or something, I'd probably put them in the uh, in the drawers. Otherwise, we've got. Oh, we can we can interact with quite a lot here. Oh, that's cool. Then we can move the camera around. That's this nicely interactive. Uh, excuse me, buddy. Is there a mystery or something? Cherub pictures. We got more pictures. Ooh, that's a big Ben right there. I wonder, are we in England? Or I mean, I I'm in England. A regular old book. Can we inspect the book? We can. I wononder if all the books work in that way whether or not there's gonna be like things hidden in books pocket watch used to save your progress it's a kind of a funky looking pocket watch item added to inventory let's see saving the progress cool <laughs> can we read this text hello Roberto first of all I apologize for not introducing myself right now you would not believe who I am neither would trust me now even so keep in mind that I am here to help you on this journey what you will get through at this hotel will not be easy, but I'm sure you'll get to your destination. I created something that will help you in this process. The watch that I sent with this envelope has some properties that many would say are supernatural. It allows you to create a point in time, and everything you have done so far will be safe at that point. That's a nice way of explaining a safe point. Remember, the only safe way to progress is to always use this unique property on this watch. To use it, always synchronize with any pendulum clock that may exist in the hotel. I remember seeing some in my days here. Oh, that's cool. Again, I'm sorry for not introducing myself. I know you very well, but you haven't met me yet, and at the right time, you will get to know me. Love, E. Thank you, E. An apparently regular book. It's kind of weird that it's just like, these are apparently regular. Stop knocking. Seriously, chill out. Essential item. Oh, that's my pocket watch. Is this? So that's, I can like combine with these things. Oh, I can combine with very Resident Evil. So I can not, I could use it, but not on that. That looks like a plug or something. Maybe we need to find like a thing to plug it into. Metal equipment. Object found during the investigation. Very strange. Seven, zero, six. So, metal equipment has numbers on it. We've got pencils. Can I just pick them up? Let me, let me pick these pencils up. That's really, really interesting that they're all like physics objects. I think that's quite cool. That's something that's well, well done. Is the, the things inside the... Oh, gauze? What does that do? It has no use on its own, but can be combined with other items to make something useful, like bandages or simple weapons. Yeah, I think that's cool. Like, the, the objects in the drawers kind of moving around, like, rather than just being, like, painted in the drawers, I suppose, like, flat textures. So we can, we can sync up with that if we want to save. Oh my god, so we can't just interact with the light switch, but we can look very closely at it. Pocket watch? I guess we'll save. 
we'll just do it for the sake of it. Cool. So is that like any any clock is a save point? And it's do we get an unlimited amount of saves at each clock? Either way, that's a very cool system. I like that. I'm getting ah backpack. Okay, cool. Oh, that's really interesting. That's well done. I like that. The items in this, when we have like the our inventory space and stuff like that, it's giving me like that classic Resident Evil vibe and the the combining, as I mentioned. It's it's all that's a, that's a good thing to see in like modern horror. I think it's rare. Messy clothes. Someone messed up my room. I wouldn't leave my clothes like this. Okay, we can't interact with anything else here. Show me what's in here. There's no fake bottoms or anything. More drawers. And then a safe. So I think that the safe code is probably the code from that metal item that we picked up. Is there anything else before we go for that? Because, ah, there's a code. That, let's see. So we got 709 or 706. And it's got to be 7069. <laughs> Which, hold on. I should, oh, my clock's gone. I could only use the clock once. Heck it. That's not cool. Okay. Um, so, seven's in the middle. Nine, seven, zero. Or zero, seven, six. So, nine, seven, zero. Ah, oh, that worked. We got a key. An old key. An old metal key. It belongs to the hotel. Cool. So, that's first puzzle solved. My afternoon snack. Some leftovers from yesterday. I like it. Like, I don't know if it, if this game then has more Resident Evil 7 vibes or if this is more of an escape room. Either outcome in that. I'm, I'm here for it. Though we can't crouch. Oh, we can't crouch. What's, how do I crouch? How did I do that? How do I do it, game? Okay, <laughs> there we go. It's uh, control. Control. I'm not... I'm not a uh, natural PC gamer, although I've gamed on PC forever. I'm not like a big FPS kind of player, so sometimes I end up looking at the keyboard and I'm like, what am I doing? Email from Stephanie. From Roberto to Stephanie. 0907 2009. Oh, wow. All the way back then. Was Google, was Gmail around in 2009? That's definitely Gmail. Good afternoon, Stephanie. My name is Roberto, and I'm a newly graduated journalist. I'm very interested in your proposal. I believe it is an excellent opportunity to develop a story and perhaps leverage my name in investigative journalism. Give me more details about the place and the events so I can start to sketch something. I'm waiting for your response. Thank you, Roberto R. From Stephanie to Roberto, 9th the 7th, 2009. Hi, Roberto. I gl <laughs> I'm glad you showed an interest in telling this story. I think we better talk on the phone to give you all the information more easily. My number is 49-555-314-159. I'm waiting for your call. Stephanie S. From Roberto to Stephanie, 9-18-2009. Where are you? I've been in this shitty place for a week and nothing happens. This city is a waste of time. I'm going to pack my stuff and tomorrow I'll be back in Sao Paulo. So that person like ghosted us? We got a key. Should we use the key? I guess on the bathroom door? Oh, no way. So even in her inventory, we can do goodbye pencils. Goodbye. Ah, that's why is that so unique? That's like such a little attention to detail thing. I'm just like, that's so good. So well done. We've investigated everything here. There's still that door being banged on, but I don't. I don't even care for it anymore. Let's uh, let's use my key. We can go through the bathroom. Maybe we'll find a way out of our room. But I, I don't want to find out what's outside there because it's scary. Another backpack? Oh my god, we can wear two backpacks at once. We're going to be a guy covered in backpacks by the end of this game. So many backpacks. So we can't turn on the shower. This game's probably... Probably a 2 out of 10 now. I, I was feeling quite good about it, but you can't turn on the shower? Adhesive plaster. Pharmaceutical use. What's this? Important to remember. One photographic camera. One lens. Six shirts. Four pants. Five underwears. Six pairs of socks. One pair of shoes. Safe's password. 35127. Meeting with Stephanie on Saturday. So, 35127. Camera lens. That's what we need. So I guess we've got to pick up the things from that inventory, that I, the list of items, but saying that we probably don't need the socks. So what was it? Uh, E35127. 
Cool. And we got a sprint button, so that's useful. But not so useful when you're indoors in like a room like this. So, oops. Three, five, one, two, seven. Wasn't a camera. Excellent. A battery and a camera. Oh, God. Are we going to have to start playing like Outlast? Are we going to have have to start um, going through this world looking for a camera all the time. How do we use the camera? So let's combine the lens and the camera. Let's combine the battery and the camera. Boom. Use. Okay, so you can use C to turn on or change between camera modes. Okay. So is there anything in this room that looks... Oh my god, what? Oh... Uh, that's I don't I don't speak what that is. <laughs> what though? That's different. Is this this isn't camera anymore, is it? This is something else. Can, oh my god, what? The heck is going on? El nombre? My little. Can we we can't open this door. The paper. Six years old girl killed. What is going on, video game? City is the stage of a revolting crime. Mother kills her daughter during last Friday night. Child inhaled kitchen gas. Police believe that mother would try to deceive authorities, making believe that it was a leak, but expertise is evidence that it was a repository act. No added, six years old girl killed. So can we, we can still cycle through the camera. It's interesting, but I don't really know what I'm supposed to be doing with this camera and all the different views. Can we just... We, oh, we can get a pocket watch back. Oh, do we have to leave the pocket watch in a place in order to save? That's crazy. There we go. So, we can actually highlight that. But it doesn't do much. Picture, oh my god, picture? What? What's this? No. Um. Can we put our camera away? Use. I guess, is that the camera away? I'm very confused by what's going on now. It's not like that obvious once you have the camera out how the controls work. It's very strange. It's hard to explain. What the fuck? Stay out of my bathroom, friender. <gasps> Whoa. You closed the bathroom door on me? Whoa! What the heck? I am not ready for any of this. Get out of my bathtub, lady. I wanted a nice, quiet hotel room. Where I could just relax. And now I've got people combusting in my bath. Thank you. At least she cleaned up after herself. Heck. What is going- can we see? So this game, beautiful graphics. Phobia, St. Dymphna Hotel. Really good looking game. Oh, there's more to this demo? I thought that would be the end, but we're just getting started. Oh my. Oh god, the door's open. No way. <laughs>